Oh, guys, we got another one today. Welcome back. Sit back, relax, and you know what? No, I'm not gonna finish it. No, no, unplug and just no, no. Sit. If you, if no, no. Generally, if you're driving, if you're driving, continue driving. If you're not driving, sit back, relax, and unplug and listen to the sound of our voices. Ready? <laughs> just the ASMR podcast. Um, but anyways, guys, we have a new guest today. His name it's it's my boy Isai. What's going on? Hey, what's up? Dude? <laughs> just chilling, man. Isai's tired. He just had an audition today. You just had an audition for who was the audition for? Uh, oh wait, can you say that or no? Yo, oh yeah. By the way, guys, Isai's an actor. No, I can't say it. Yeah. You can't say that you're an actor. I oh can't no, you say can't say the audition. audition. Oh, okay, no, okay, yeah, I can't. okay. Yeah, no, this is on. This is going on the internet. But um, <laughs> it's like it's like you don't know that. Yeah. It's like we're just we're just sending it to our few friends back home. <laughs> just a few friends. Um, no, hey, but mom. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, but uh, yeah, you're an actor. So what's what's being an actor like in LA? Like I'm just I'm I'm so curious because I I literally I literally don't know anybody who's an actor. Um, yeah, so being an actor, like, in L.A. especially, it's, like, really hard to be, like, consistent and motivated. Yeah. Because Cause I feel like you have auditions, like, fairly yeah, often. Yeah, I get, like, two or three auditions every week. That's, isn't that good? Yeah, it's really good. Most yeah. Most people get, like... One a month. One or two yeah. a month. Yeah. But it's just because of my luck and... Yeah, and you have, a, you have a good manager and probably... Right, right. right. Yeah. I have a manager, oh, yeah. both an agent. Yeah, so... so it's it's pretty good, but being an actor in LA, it's it's really hard because you just you're being judged all the time. Uh, you have to learn like how to keep going. Yeah, you have rejection. to. You have to. Yeah, I was gonna say you have to know how to be like criticized and stuff. Yeah, like that. yeah. And it's just it's tough, man. Yeah. Especially when you're new. Yeah. And not known, and you don't know anybody. Yeah. And you don't and have that's friends, tough. Yeah, and yeah. You're alone. <laughs> <laughs> and you're a fucking loser. No. <laughs> Yeah, no. but no, you, you started so, talking to me about that too, and like just the fact that everybody just kind of feels so much better than you, because like anybody with a following is just doesn't care. Like if, yeah, if you're just you, starting out. Oh, we had like, we had know. that we had a little yeah. interaction somewhere where somebody with a following didn't give two shits about us. <laughs> yeah. Am I gonna say who the, who it was? No. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> but um. <laughs> I'm did, just kidding. <laughs> yeah, but um, so you started you started off in Texas, right? Or that's where yeah. you that's where you're from. You're from yeah, Texas. Yeah, I'm from Texas, and I started off in Texas. Uh, I was acting. Straight started, out of high school, right? No, no, no. I dropped out of college and then did acting. What what year? Like, was it your freshman year? Uh, no, I did three semesters of college, and then I decided to do acting. Oh, that's right. Yeah, because you're you're almost you're 21 right yeah, now, right? 21. When's your 20 second birthday? Right? Yeah. It's in August. Oh, so, oh my gosh, so you'll be 22 soon. Yeah, Leo. The big T2. It's a T2. Big T2. Yeah. <laughs> so you had your first, you had your first feature film in Texas. You had, like, did the audition everything in Texas, right? Yeah, everything was in Texas. And then the, everything was filmed, everything? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It, it was... You weren't, like, have you, like, back then, like, have you thought about moving to, like, L.A. and, like, you know, kind of going to L.A. and pursue acting? Or, like, were you just like, all right, let's see how this goes? You know, if yeah. I can nail this, then maybe I'll probably think about moving to L.A. Yeah, the plan was always, like, to move to L.A., you know, and try it out and see what it's like to be an actor out here. Yeah. And, fuck, like, <laughs> it's, it's so tough. hard. Yeah, yeah. No, it's <laughs> so hard, man. It's just, it's it's tough when you don't have family or friends out here. Yeah. And um, I didn't have a place to live. I was basically living in my car out here for, like, two weeks two or three months mm -hmm. yeah you were telling me that yeah and it's, it's yeah it's so like depressing <laughs> Jesus. So, Somebody, so... somebody's gonna listen to this and be like i really want to try acting and they're gonna be like, be like you know what dude maybe i'll just maybe i'll just sit behind a desk no i'm just kidding but <laughs> honestly though if anything that's kind of good advice in a sense of like that, that not is, walking cool. in expecting it to be easy like the, anybody that yeah. should be doing it should expect like the yeah, I should expect it to be hard. Danny, like should be Danny Duncan. We, we both know. We both know D Danny Duncan. Um, kind of. Um, he tweeted the other day. He tweeted a screenshot, and I, I really like this. I, I'm I'm glad that he tweeted this. He screeted. Uh, yes, yeah, screeted. Screen he screenshotted <laughs> a text message from him and his friend. Oh yeah. Did you see this too? Mm -hmm. Yeah. He he texted his friend. He's like, uh, no, his friend texted him. This was back in 2015, and his friend texted him, and he was like, hey, uh, Danny, are you moving? Are you really moving to Cali? And he was like, yeah, bro, I'm going out there. 
um, in like two weeks and he was like, damn, I need to get myself out there. He was like, yeah, I already have a car out there. I'm just going to live in my car for a little while and then I'm going to move on and, and move into my friend's couch. And then like that, and now like his position today is like, you know, like Danny's like, I'm, like he's on top, you know, he's, he's freaking, you know, ruling YouTube. So like, I really like that, like, you know, he was talking about like the struggle of like, you know, it's not like all just, you know. Like, he's not a one-hit wonder. Like, he worked his way up, and, yeah. you know, he, like, earned to where he is. Five so. years, dude. Took yeah. Like five years yeah, it's been five like years. Really big. Yeah. Like, yeah. he really got big in 2019. Yeah, he blew, he blew up last year for sure. And he's freaking still going hard. Yeah. Like, he's been going hard. It's insane how far he's come, yeah. you know? But how, how we met him was... I, I, it's funny how we met, because we met through Chris Chan. Yeah, and like, if nobody knows who Chris Chan is, he's a he's a skateboarder. He, he, yeah, he's a fucking douchebag. Yeah, he's an asshole. We will hate him. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, no, he's he's a he's he does YouTube. He's been doing YouTube for, I think six or seven years. He said, which is really a long time. God, this guy's old, so old. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> just, we just start talking trash about him. No, but yeah, no. Chris is like uh, Chris is a YouTuber, and he's he also skateboards. And I met him. I met Chris through my my our, our friend Seth. Um, Seth is in like the box squad. If, if nobody knows who Seth is, and uh, Seth Francois, and I met I met Chris at um, at a Logan Paul fight, and then I started hanging. I hang out. I hung out with Chris like one time, and the one time I hung out with him, he brought me to this event that I actually. Well, I don't know if I should say that. I'm gonna say it. I don't care. I wasn't supposed to go to it. Like I wasn't allowed to be there just because I I think um you had to had either you had to be invited. Or you you had to have like a certain amount of followers, like what I was told you had to have like over twenty k or whatever, and so I was I wasn't really allowed to go, but Chris you know wanted to bring me, um, and so I went with him, and then that's where and then he said, oh my boy Isai's here, I'm like fuck, how do you pronounce his name? And then because I didn't want to go up and be like, hey burrito, <laughs> like burrito. <laughs> hey burrito, <laughs> like I didn't want to go up and and like just say like hey I. I don't know your name, hey, like, Bruno. but, uh, <laughs> well, you couldn't think of anything else, you fucking racist, <laughs> <laughs> burrito, <laughs> no, I meant, like, the acai bowl, I'm just kidding, oh, oh, <laughs> you actually get mad, no, but, um, but, yeah, no, I thought that was kind of, and then you met Chris in, a, in like, a parking lot, yeah, it was, like, random, I just remember, that was, like, my first time, like, seeing, like, anybody, like, celebrity-wise, like, randomly, yeah. in the streets, yeah, that was like that was his big yeah like yeah being from Texas like in a small town everything's so like boring nobody ever goes there so like seeing Chris like in the street was like what like yeah this it was is normal it was like dude holy crap Chris Chan like is that what you said when you went up to him no I remember just like seeing him <coughs> and I was like no way that's Chris Chan oh that's that's like, crazy dude that's so weird if you if you didn't run into him we wouldn't be friends. Yeah, and that freaking crazy. If you yeah, didn't like, if you didn't, if you didn't go to that parking lot on that day, we would have never met. Yeah, it was Josh, literally, weird. You've told me about you meeting people twice in parking lots. It's always parking lots in LA that. Are, yeah, it's dude. It's, it's freaking thing. insane. I've gotten like crazy. I like the people that like, I'm friends with, like I'm like I'm, uh, like Cam, our friend Cam, Cam Casey. I met him by accident. Like I literally wasn't supposed to be there, mm-hmm. and then I and then I met him. Like you, like met Chris in randomly in a parking lot. I wasn't supposed to go to that party or that event. The and best then, things happen yeah, when it's you crazy. don't know they're gonna happen. Yeah, it's like, it's, uh, it's all so accidental. crazy. It's so crazy. It's 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 yeah. It's definitely strange how how that how that you, all did happened. You, did you guys watch the Oscars? Because I know Josh said you'd watch it, but I don't know if you said you watched it. Oh yeah, yeah. I went to. I, I Oscar haven't seen Vian the party. Oscars. No. I know. I, as an actor, you didn't watch the Oscars. I don't Did you have read? cable. <laughs> oh, what about like YouTube? Would it be like? Oh, I did mean, you watch like highlights of it? Maybe I watched a couple of highlights. Did you see who like have like what's your? Because all right, all right, I think this is really funny. So David, mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, you're not you're not a movie person, right? Well, okay. How about this? I appreciate movies, but I'm not like. No, like I don't know many movies, but it's not. All right, like you I say don't you you are a movie person, right? Mm-hmm. Obviously, you know, being an actor, of course. Well, <laughs> oh, actually, I'm curious. Before before I bring this up, um, before I bring up the the little beef, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but <laughs> what movie? What movie like inspired you to become? A, oh, I know this one actually. What movie inspired, inspired me, me to, to be yeah an actor? to be an actor? Yeah, uh, Star Wars: Revenge of the Sith. Yep. Oh David, no, have you seen Star I hate Wars? you. I hate you. <laughs> He's never Why seen Star Wars. <laughs> 
I was a kid, man. Just Star Wars like was so amazing to me. Like seeing that in theaters was like, holy fuck, I want to do this. Yeah, you know? Jessica throw me under the bus every time. Yeah, he's never he's never seen Star Wars. He's never seen Star Wars. No, you should watch Star Wars, dude. I think it'd be awesome. Dude, you've been telling me you you're gonna give me the Disney. Uh, oh, that's right. I need Plus to give you my Disney like, Plus account. What is it? I think since like two months. I think it's, it's been it's been yeah it's been so since the to him right now. Exchange Should the I... info right now. All right, I'll I'll do it. I'll do it right after. Disney knows <laughs> Josh Van Van Bruyne. Yeah. <laughs> Gmail dot com. His password's Joshy Poo. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, no, any even even any yeah even any chain, but um. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? I just thought his password's like David Dobrik fan. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I wouldn't put it past him. Oh, um, this is funny. Y- speaking of like being a, like a fan, you're a fan of you're a fan of Bozzy. Yeah, you're a big fan of Bozzy. Yeah. We we were at we were at Saddle Ranch last night, and we were just we were there to hang out. We we saw we saw our friend there. We were talking to our friend for a little while, and then you know we saw a couple of people that. You know, our, our like our friends that we were with like wanted to to meet, and so we were you know trying to like get them to you know talk and stuff, and then and then we saw um you're you're a big fan of the reality house like he and JC's reality house yeah, right? Yeah, I've been watching them for years. Yeah, dude. and we saw JC last night, and and he said he was like, dude, we gotta go like say hi to him, and I was like I was like yeah, dude, I'm totally down, let's go. And so like I went up and like I was like, yo, what's going on, bro? You know, love the show, whatever, blah blah blah, and then you know like I. I Told you to. Uh, I I brought you over to say hi to him, and then we we were talking to J. You you talked to J. C. for a little bit, and then you saw in like the corner of your eye, like Bozzy. And yeah. if you if you if you guys don't know who Bozzy is, he's a real like a really famous singer, mm-hmm. and he has a song. It's like he's pro- yeah, I think it's the most popular song. What star is pretty star is pretty popular. Yeah, oh, the star, star the song star. star. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and then I feel like is mine. Like, see, he has a song called Mine, yeah. just like M I N E. It's got a few songs that are pretty popular. Yeah, he he has a lot. He has a lot of songs popular, but like mine's like, like uh, you so fucking precious when you smile. Like that's yeah. like, and like when you when you show me that song because yeah, I, I didn't know who he was, and you were like, dude, I'm I'm, I'm like what? It's freaking Bozzy. I'm like, is he a YouTuber? <laughs> like I didn't I didn't know who that was, and and then Rachel and then our friend Rachel was with us, and she was like, you don't know who Bozzy is? I'm like, I'm I don't know names. I'm he so sorry. He was a YouTuber. <laughs> and <laughs> dude, because I, I didn't know who it was, I was like, is, does he make does he play video games or something like that? Um, but no, and then you like told me like we you showed me a song after in the car, and I was like, oh, I know this guy, and it was yeah. so crazy like that he was there because he's a huge singer. Yeah, so I didn't I didn't expect him. There. Yeah, I so, I wouldn't expect I feel like. The other we we saw like another random person at um at Saddle Ranch one time. This is it's so weird like go like going out like cause Saddle Ranch is like this big bar slash restaurant that like a lot of like influencers or like content creators hang out at and now TikTokers are invading it. Um, <laughs> and so the we we me and you said you were there one night and all yeah, a bunch of influencers there, whatever. And we see Aaron Aaron what's his last name? Aaron Carpenter or whatever. Oh yeah, Aaron Carpenter. Yeah, Aaron Carpenter. He's he's a he's huge. Um, like he's a massive singer. He's like yeah. friends with Selena Gomez. He's friends with, or he's like best friends with Selena, right? Uh yeah. I is. remember it was so funny. I remember um, we were sitting down at the table, and then I looked up at him, and I, I like got freaked out because I thought like. I thought like I don't know what the fuck happened to your face because I thought it was I thought it was you like for a split second because I looked up, and, and then um. Yeah, just and then everybody was saying that you guys looked alike, and I thought that was really funny. Yeah, you guys should have got a picture. So I know I, I, I wish, wish we got a picture, man. But yeah, I don't know. It was just so weird seeing him there because we were wearing the same thing too. We were both wearing black jeans and uh, dark green hoodies. Oh, we, that's right! We I remember. Yeah, because outfit. because David uh, D- David David Dobrik was there. And he walked up, and didn't he? Didn't he like was like, holy shit! Like you guys, yeah, are you guys twins or some shit? Yeah, David yeah. was like, holy. Because he went to go say fuck. bye to Aaron because yeah. they, he he just met him that night. Yeah, that's that was really funny. But um, but speaking of TikTokers invading, do you think they're gonna take over the U.S. one day? <laughs> do I think TikTok? No, just kidding. Them? Yeah, <laughs> I think oh, Charlie D'Amelio is gonna be the first black yeah. president. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, no, what do you think about TikTok though? I'm curious. I'm always cur- I always like talking. About TikTok to, to just bring just bring it up in conversation. I think TikTok's really like, really cool. Like just because like how much content on there is like really like original and funny. Yeah. Like I just feel like Instagram's so like, you know like, 
too much of the same thing going on and, and with TikTok it's like everybody's got like their own unique style and like comedy and that's like what I really like about it too is like the algorithm how it gets all these new people out like on yeah. your phone it's just Do you I think, think it's so cool were you, were you ever on Vine because when Vine yeah. came out you were what like 16 maybe was uh, that, it was like, I was like I don't know you were in some high school no, yeah. no. Yeah, I was like fourteen. It was Vine that long ago? Oh my yeah. god, yeah. Oh my. Well, you were Lord, just talking about that dude. last episode. How it was like out for a while. Like, yeah. I, I didn't think it was out for that long at all. Because I only heard about it, like I said, like right at the end. Were, yeah. Were you Were you on Vine? Yeah, I was on Vine. Did you like? Did, were you like a content creator? Or, I, don't, uh, I, don't I mean, were you a I never <laughs> tried like hard on it. I never tried. Like getting like famous or whatever. Yeah, I remember I just made like a couple you just, vines. Like, you're just, just trying to have fun. fun with it. Yeah, I was just doing it for fun. I remember you told me um, that I, I I don't know like I mean it's, I don't think it's a, a big thing now, but when when Vine two came out, like it came out like what but I mean technically. It, it do you know? Out, wait, yeah. David, do you know about this? Well, I I know about it. I know about its existence. Yeah, but it's called Bite. Which is a weird name, Dan. <laughs> yeah, it's, I don't know how it's that happened. Bite, and so instead of being a viner, you're a biter. I, yeah, You're I, haven't, I haven't opened the app since and it, it came and it's, out. Instead of, instead of a revine, it's rebite. That's like literally what it is. It's wicked <laughs> yeah, that's funny. That's so bad. I don't like that. Yeah, I don't a like it. A rebite? Either, yeah, it's called a rebite, yeah. I remember what, what it was so a, funny. What's a, re-ti- what is what's a re-tick-tock? <laughs> re-tick, there is no a re-tick-tock? Oh, okay. A re That's what you're saying. Oh, my God. But, um... I, uh, I mean, no, TikToker I'm, I'm, sounds I'm, ridiculous. I'm, I'm definitely gonna say it. I I definitely think that that TikTok is is better than Vine. Yeah, just I, because of how much you can do on it. Right. Like, there's a video. Like, I'm I usually make like like kind of like comedy skits or like I'll either like put in like my old vlog footage. But like, there's a new project that I'm working on, which which you helped me out with. Was um I'm taking a, a disposable camera, and I I took one picture of it. It's just a picture of me. And then I'm gonna hide it somewhere in LA, and I'm gonna make a video of like me hiding it and like showing everybody like where I'm, you know, where I'm hiding in LA. And then people are gonna have to like go and like try to find this disposable camera, and then they can basically do the same thing with it. And I think that's like, I think it's like a really cool idea, just because like I, I haven't seen it done on TikTok before. Mm-hmm. I mean, if people have done it, it's maybe if it's failed, but like I really hope it doesn't flop. Have you ever thought about like? What if, like, a random-ass homeless guy or some crackhead just picks it up and, like... Just destroys it. That would just... suck, dude. That would suck. I really want this to work. I think I think if, it, like, if it works with, like, the second person, then I think they'll be able to get, like, their friend or, like, possibly somebody else to, yeah. have, it, to have it done, you know? Or, like, or like worse comes to worse, if, like, if it doesn't blast off with the second person, like, one of our friends could maybe do it. I don't know. I mean, I don't want to, like, fake it, I, I but... feel like the second person would, like do it though just because it did like they'd be the first ones to find it and be like oh my god i, I actually found it i actually found yeah, it yeah like, i'm gonna yeah, put like, it i'm like gonna put it in this to keep it going yeah right yeah like, they wouldn't like want to be like i don't know if they, they would they yeah. would be such jerks if they dude it would dude, I, it. dude i feel like i feel like if it does like blow up and like somebody does find it and just like takes it then that that would suck i feel well, like i mean would if they're if, if somehow person. it's someone that's hearing this they're gonna do it now See that now, if somebody if somehow they hear this now they're gonna break it hearing us talking about breaking it yeah but I mean yeah. good we don't it's good that we don't have that much reach right now so <laughs> yeah no I I think I think it'll I think it I think it'll blow up I hopefully like I don't want it to like blow up and and get five million views overnight like I would like to like you know like have like a lot of people like message me and be like damn that's a cool ass idea like i'm gonna try to find it tomorrow like with my friends like that would be so crazy dude yeah like yeah so i think that would be cool anyways um guys uh, i'm on twitter right now i'm trying to find i'm trying to find like just like little topics to talk about this is what we usually do during the podcast actually and... some, something i do want to bring up it's kind of random but yeah did you uh you, you know with the logan paul anthony brown thing right yeah, Antonio, Antonio Brown. Anthony Brown. I wanted to call him Brown. Anthony. Antonio Brown. <laughs> I just I said it. I was like, that doesn't Anthony. sound right. <laughs> no, yeah. that was awful. Uh, yeah. Did you Did you see the diss track that he put out? I did not. He no. Yeah. I, I I saw I saw like a little Twitter video of it, but I didn't see the full thing. It's actually kind of sick. Like I kind of. I actually kind of like it. Like did it's kind. It? It's kind of good. I'm not gonna lie. 
Oh, and I'll have to watch it. I know, I know he's been fun. wanting to like jump into music, and I'm not gonna lie, it kind of intrigues me. Like, I'm kind of curious what's. Uh... I- I'm not gonna lie. I know a lot of people don't like Logan Paul. I don't, are you are you a fan of Logan Paul? Uh, or like, are you do you no. not like really care? I, I don't really care. Okay. Oh, well, I'm not gonna lie. I kind of like his vlogs recently. You punch me. Watched face. any of them? <laughs> I haven't seen them. What have you seen them, Dave? No, I haven't watched any of them. I, I know he. Keep, they're, he they're, I mean, they keep. Everyone's talking about them, but they're really good, and he's getting like really good views on them too. Like for like what he used to get. Like I feel like he used to get like. Well, because I heard they're very million... David Dobrik-y, so of course you like them. <laughs> I know that that's the thing that that's what that's why he mentioned like David like the last vlog just because oh, yeah, did you hear they are they're shorter <laughs> like, did they're you hear big, about yeah them it's exposing yeah yeah the Tanner that Fox came crazy. in crazy if that's true yeah, the, if that's actually true oh that it is, the it is biggest true. expose I think, I've I think, ever I think it's true we wouldn't yeah but well, that's he, that's like cares, not so. yeah but that's a big deal if it's like it, come on. Come on. Okay, and you said just know what we're talking about. So to explain. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah you definitely. So on, on one of Logan Paul's the last videos or a couple of vlogs ago, he was hanging out with Tanner Fox, and um, they were trying to like make, create a thumbnail. And then Tanner, and then somebody said, I forget who said this, but somebody said, just do the David Dobrik thumbnail. And like they like you know had their face like ah oh, like oh my god like this oh, happened. Yeah. And then Logan brought up like how he has you know that image and literally every one of his thumbnails is just like the same exact face basically. Mm-hmm. Or, or like every other video or whatever and then Tanner brought up he's like did you guys know that he like he fakes the laughs or something like that like he records a group of his friends like laughing in the living room like ha 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 and then he just puts that over a part that doesn't really have a lot of laughter after at, at the end of it oh really yeah is that Which, true I think it's true yeah I mean I don't I don't care like the video's good yeah, but that's or whatever. so like, not that's like reality TV you think so that's like I feel, dude, I knew that like a while laugh ago. Tracks, dude. That's a like that's a literally shame. a laugh track. Yeah, I, I, I knew that a while ago. I I've done that. What? No yeah, I've way, done that. Dude. that then yeah. it has then it's because so I'm a, smooth. I'm a great like, editor. I've never you can't noticed. Tell. Oh, give you me know a break. what? Let's, dude. let's let's test it. Let's test it. Let's do let's do a let's record a little laugh track of all of us laughing. Okay. And then, let's, and then I'll put it in the let's vlog. Let's make a little skit right after, and then just edit the little laugh track onto it. You want to do it? <laughs> do you want it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, um, everybody laugh in three, two. <laughs> oh my dude that's great <laughs> oh, that's good oh my god <laughs> all right and then ready and i'm gonna say the joke all right and three two one the water bottle fell from the table <laughs> oh my dude that's great that's good oh my god i don't even know <laughs> <laughs> i don't think no one else gonna turn it out uh guys if you if you guys if you guys want you guys can leave the podcast now it's over now <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. No, don't leave. But um, but yeah, no, we'll, but we'll put um, a laugh track yeah, on that. Joke no, I, I think I think yeah, yeah. <laughs> 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 oh my dude, that's great. <laughs> that's right. um, that's good. No, but yeah, that I think. Yeah, I, I do think I do think that David does that. Not not all the time. You, you say just dropped his phone. <laughs> not not, oh, not all dude, the that's time. Great. But I do think that. Like he does it once in a while. Where if like a clip, like sometimes like I like a clip and it's like really good, mm-hmm. and it'll just be like just me and like one other friend and like it'll just be like weird if like just he's laughing and like i'm like like you know i'm like about to laugh but like i don't laugh soon i don't know sometimes like the timing of like the laughter just doesn't line up so you like just want to like add it in but yeah i've, I've done that i've done that a few times that's so crazy yeah, yeah if you think about I it i can't believe I, it's that's that's but it, but i remember like because his like his vlogs got like compared to like a sitcom but like that's like literally what happens at the end of like like every like scene, like it's like a la- it was like a laugh track of like the audience. I, it's just weird that I've never even sp- like uh, suspected, like thought about it. Yeah, I just never, th- I, like I, I never. Th- I think it's, I've it's so I've well noticed it before. Really? I've well, noticed I'm sure it. Now yeah, I'm yeah. It was it, it was in one of his uh, it was in one of like his second channel videos, and he had a, uh, he had like a uh, yeah, he put like a I I could tell like there was a laugh track, and then. Um, and also, like, th- like, it was, like, with Emma Chamberlain, it was, like, a skit with Emma Chamberlain. You'd probably go find her or something like that, I don't know what it was, but... Do you know how funny it would be if one do- one time he'll, like, he'll be, like, editing some video, and then by accident forgets, like, a laugh track in the wrong spot, and then just uploads it? <laughs> <laughs> it's just, like, during, just, um, <laughs> during a serious moment. It's like, oh, it's, like a, it's, like, an old, like, it's on, like, an old, like, like, movie. 
like an old like Chinese or like Japanese, but like the Godzilla thing. Yeah. <laughs> when you when, so when you just say like when you just like it's like oh my gosh it's Godzilla and then like they're running away <laughs> and like and then you just hear oh my gosh it's Godzilla like it's just it's just like in the wrong place. Are you just being, Those are like, like the... I'm sponsored by spon- uh, uh oh my god Seat Geek and then it's just a laugh yeah. track. <laughs> oh my, dude, that's <laughs> great. <laughs> yeah, that's but no, oh I I do god. like I do like Logan's like I do like Logan's new style. And it's not and it's not because it's like it's short like like David's vlogs. I think it's literally he literally said like he tweeted out or he tweeted this or said on his podcast or what I don't know what he said on. But um he said it's literally I I like the vlogs I'm doing now because um I'm being a lot more myself and I'm just being more genuine. And and then he made like a joke about like like who knew that people would like you for who you are like that like because obviously I feel like everybody likes you for who you are like people don't like when you, you know you're being fake you know so I, I like I like that part like about it I think that works do you think that works David uh I'm not gonna lie you your voice cut off for a second on my end so I actually have no but do you know what I said? Let's play the guessing game. Uh, literally, all I heard was Logan Paul and him talking about being yourself, and then it, your voice just died from that. Well, he yeah, he made Cam Casey called me. He made a joke about um, about like who knew that people would like you for being yourself. Yeah, and like in like you know like usually like everybody likes like people for who they are, not like for being like a fake you know people. Like people don't like yeah, when yeah. people are no, fake on the yeah. internet because it's just like. Like a lot of people like complain. Like oh I'm, just, I'm not gonna like. Oh name my god! It. Wait. <laughs> What's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? No, I just I, I can't even say it on a. I feel oh, like, is it, like you is probably is know somebody. Well, yeah, just connect yeah. the dots, but just keep going. Yeah, I know who you're talking about. I'll talk to. You. I'll tell you about it after. That's <laughs> so, that's so <laughs> <fun>. <laughs> okay. Um. That's so bad. That. that okay. But let, let's just. But let's just say. Um, Let's just say, for example, like a YouTuber is, is like you know being really fake, you know, in, on his videos, or like a, or like a TikToker, for example, like TikToker or YouTuber, and they're like really fake on their videos, and then when they meet the fans in real life, the fans are like, like fuck are like, like where like who are you, you fucking moron? Like why are you such a loser? Yeah. But, you know, like they meet the person, and they're just like, why are you so boring? You know, but, like if they meet, like if Logan Paul, like. I, like, I feel like Logan Paul, like in his new videos, is is who he is, like in real life. Because I've talked, I've talked to him before. Like I've been like at a couple events where like he's at, like his events, not like random events. Yeah. And you know, I feel like he he is like who he is in real life. And like same, you know, same with like David Dobrik. I feel like he, who he is. And there's a couple other YouTubers that, like, there was a YouTuber actually at the event that we went to, mm-hmm. and and he was like he's like an ex finer. I'm not gonna say who it was, but um, but he's so different in real life. Like he's real, he's really different. Really, he's very like. Yeah, like he's a lot more like calm. He's not like he's not really super energetic. He's kind of just like hanging out, you know. So, but I feel like when he turns on that camera, he's just like a totally different person. Yeah, he plays a character. Yeah, like a totally different. And like you know, that can work in like that can work in some cases, but like I feel like when you go to like a meet and greet, and people expect like this really energetic guy, and then he's just like. Hey, what's going on, guys? How's it going? Like that, and people are like, "Oh, for Christ's sakes! Yeah. Like, come on!" Well, I think yeah. that's why, like, the Sucks, uh, Logan Paul's podcast also has been just doing really well. Yeah, because he's he just talks about like, oh, I don't listen to his podcast, but like he just talks about like himself and stuff. <laughs> well, I don't even listen to the podcast. No, I, I actually listen. Well, I don't to listen to the podcast. I listen to a couple it's, episodes. It's not that bad at all. That's good. It's pretty funny. <laughs> that's good. <laughs> that, that, that's that's okay. Good. But uh, yeah, nothing can top. This podcast, though. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, guys, we're, we're veering. We're veering towards the end right now. Uh, I have to go do my project that I'm working on. I'm going to go hide that. I'm going to go hide it in a... I'm just, I'm just going to say it right now because I'm, I'm going to put up the video tonight. Or tomorrow morning. I'm going to put it up tomorrow morning. But, um, but I'm going to hide it. There's, like, this really famous spot in L.A. called, like, this, like... I don't know what it's called, like the swing over the edge or some shit. I don't it's know. Just near, like, people people call it the TikTok swing, because <laughs> yeah. like it's it blew up on TikTok. Like some girl like posted a video saying like, all right, so most you know probably a lot of people in LA like you know know about this, but there's a really cool spot in you know Iceland Park, and it's like a it's a swing that overlooks like you know Burbank and Glendale, and I think it's like a really cool like area to like you know like swing, and um, yeah. 
like that, and then, and then she like shows the video of like where it is, and then like it blew up. Now, at, dude, we literally went to it, and we were like, waiting in line for like 10, 15 minutes, like just to freaking get pictures on the swing. Yeah, that was so weird. How so many. People it was were there was a ton of people there, yeah. right? Yeah, it was freaking crazy. But yeah, so I, just for a swing, just, just a swing. swing. I'll post a picture on Instagram so you can see Dave. Yeah, but um, but yeah, I'll guys. Wait for you. Yeah, that's LA, yeah. But people like getting their pictures taken. But um <laughs> but yeah, that's it. That's the end of the podcast, guys. Um follow Issa. Do you want That was a short one. Well, how long is that? I don't even, I can't even see the time. It was like thirty. Thirty minutes? Yeah. Should we go longer? Josh always just I mean it, I don't know. It, it's up to you really. Do you have any do you have any topics that we should talk about or should we just cut it here and, and... Well we well, last time you you didn't we didn't talk about the the halftime show because we were gonna do that and then we forgot. Oh, let's and talk about the halftime show. Did you watch the halftime show? Yeah, I watched that. What did you show. think about it? Oh I, my god, I could go in on this actually. What did you think <laughs> about it? I thought it was fucking like really good compared to like previous halftime Pre- shows. Previous halftime shows, okay. Yeah, I agree. It's just I I felt like it was way more entertaining and. Oh my god, I, my neck. I like how J Lo like did the whole kids in the cages thing. I was yeah. like, oh. Shit. I thought I thought it was great. <laughs> I thought it was so good. Yeah. I thought I thought yeah. it was really good. I didn't. I watched it. Um. I didn't like. I wasn't like. I, I mean, I, I'm not a big fan of like the 49ers or the Chiefs. So you know, I, I was kind of rooting for the 49ers because you know Jimmy Garoppolo's patriot, ex patriot, whatever. And you know my uncle, uh, my uncle's live in San Fran. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. Um, I was rooting for Shakira. <laughs> just like I didn't, I didn't, I didn't watch, I didn't watch the, I didn't watch the game. It's so funny. People have like yeah, I mean, yeah. huge parties here, and like, like you went to a Super Bowl party. Did 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 people mm-hmm. actually? Did people watch the game? Were people uh, intrigued? More people were like were wanting socializing the, than, than watching, watching the game. game. But when the halftime show came on, people watched that. Ah. Uh... Because I feel like I that's a so, yeah. because I feel like that's a big thing. Like people have like huge Super Bowl parties just to have a party. Like right. don't even they well, don't yeah. even care about who's playing. They just want to have a party. Like that's what I f- thought that was wicked funny. Well, like I, I, I was worried f- though because like the last last good halftime show I, in my opinion was like I don't know like the one where Bruno Mars performed. Bruno Mars which was, was great. like years ago. Justin Tim- I like Justin Timberlake like, and I like one and I like really yeah I I don't know I like all the halftime shows. I think everybody does a really good job on them. Bruno Mars was great. Um, who was recent? Lady Gaga, uh, Coldplay. Adam Levine uh, was last one. Adam, yep, yeah, Adam Levine was the last one. And then uh, Justin like, Timberlake. I don't like the Maroon 5. One. You don't like the Maroon 5? I don't even yeah, really remember. Yeah, none of the uh, band members were actually playing. The oh, they weren't? No, they weren't. Oh, my gosh. That just it brings them down. Fake, yeah. It was all Oh, no. Oh, Lady Gaga was all real. I love Lady Gaga. Yeah. Lady Gaga, I remember she like tweeted something at Shakira and J-Lo, and she was like, make sure... I don't see you guys lip syncing. Like she was like, "Don't, don't do that," because like people will get really pissed off if they see you guys lip sync. Yeah, that. Oh, that. Which is kind of insane because their voices were insane. Yeah, they weren't lip syncing, dude. Yeah, for Sha- how much dude, like Shakira, dancing they were doing. Shakira's and J Lo's voice are ridiculous. Shakira is not real. Dude. I, I still. Yeah, I don't that. understand how. She's much like, energy how she old has. is she? Because they're both like fairly old I'm not for what they're doing. I'm not gonna lie to you. Yeah, they're. I don't know. I feel like Shakira stole the show though. Yeah. Oh yeah. She's ridiculous. She's such a good dancer too. I don't. I, yeah. Um. Spe- oh, speaking of dancing, did you guys see Charlie D'Amelio on like on the Super Bowl commercial? Oh the. No, I just heard She's like okay, boomer. Yeah. Did you see that? Yeah, I saw. Oh yeah, that. it's freaking crazy, what? dude. It's so <laughs> weird. They made an okay, boomer joke. Yeah. On halftime show. Yeah, yeah. This this old guy was like this old oh, guy. He's probably like fifty. God. Um, but it, I, I get like he's supposed to be like a boomer or whatever. And this this guy is like eating crackers or something like that. He's like. Mm. They taste so good, mm, like that. And she's and she just looks at him. And she's like, "Okay, boomer," like that. Like <laughs> so, I feel like people watching it, like just like adults watching it, um, are just like, "Okay," like I don't fucking understand that. <laughs> so I I think it's kind of like like I don't know I don't know if it like backfired or I mean it probably didn't backfire like nothing they, they didn't get any backlash for it but like it's like I feel Honestly, like a lot they of probably just probably didn't did. know what to do with her. They 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 guarantee you they wanted to do something with her and they just didn't know what to do with her. Yeah, he's so they're so. like, all right, just say okay, boomer. I mean, that's well, that's, like, that's what are they gonna have her do? Just the renegade? That, <laughs> like, <laughs> the renegade. renegade. Yo, renegade, it's the halftime renegade, show. Renegade, renegade. Well, she did. Um, she got to dance with J Lo, in in like their practice, which is which is really cool. And I remember watching yeah, a video. Really cool. I thought this was really cool. Actually, this is this is actually why I like Charlie. I think she's a cool TikToker. Um, there was a like, an interview with her and some like media news outlet of. Uh, of they were like, so you got to dance with J Lo today, huh? And she was like bawling her eyes out, 
Like, she was literally like, yeah, I can't believe it. Like, this has been my dream for, like, f- since, I've, since I started dancing when I was four years old. And, like, now, like, you know, 11 years later, she's dancing with, like, f- you know, her idol. Like, her, like, god, you know? Like, I think she's still, like, 15 or 16. Yeah, she's 15 years old. It's That's freaking crazy. I, feel, I I don't know. I mean, Dave, you, you tell me this because you, you, I, I feel like you know Justin Bieber more than I do. Or unless you do. I have no idea. I don't know much about Justin Bieber. I'd but when he definitely. blew up, when he blew up, was it this big as Charlie D'Amelio? Or was it was it probably bigger? Yeah. No, I – well, because he blew up with, like, Baby. So it's like how, how – remember how big Baby was? Yeah, Baby was pretty big. Like – I. I, I would say, I think Justin Bieber, in my opinion, <clears throat> oh my god, my voice, I think in my opinion, he's a lot more, like, his growth was a lot more revolutionary just because there was nothing like him at the time. Yeah, like, He was the true. first yeah. artist to, like, come up from yeah, the, the yeah, internet yeah. at oh, that people, age. People might get mad at me for that, actually. Yeah. Like, honestly, if it wasn't for <laughs> Justin Bieber, I don't think there would have been a Charlie, in a sense. Like, in I a could, way. Because, like, yeah. Justin was the first artist like, like if, to come up that like way like that young too like he was like 16 yeah he well like, specifically from the internet like yeah. from youtube like yeah that was the first youtube star yeah because he was just playing guitar right and then somebody was yeah like, which, was speaking like, of oh, that yeah. he he just hit he's the number one artist in the world yeah 62 like, million like, listen or something to. like that that's right? nuts that's so it was like i don't, I don't even know i think it was like that's it was like so 62 crazy, million though. something freaking crazy dude like that's insane like i'm trying to think of like like other month i'm pretty sure that's monthly yeah it is God, dude, that's insane. Which is how much should the yeah, it's how, 62 million. How much should like the Beatles have? Uh, I'll check it. Uh, yeah, because like I remember like there was like a little like I I, I don't know. 21. 21 million. I still million. think it's yeah, so insane, like r- cool how like the Beatles still are like listened to so much. Yeah. Like, what is it? Ness like, was like it's still so, <laughs> 70 <laughs> years, 60 years yeah, later. Yeah, probably then. Holy How much is Drake? It would have been 60 years. It was 19, 19 like, 60s. Yeah, the 60s. That was Drake is 53 million. That's insane. Yeah, Drake is 53 million. Drake's a freaking legend, man. But, but yeah, it's been 60, yeah, it was 60, it's 1960s, so it's been 40. So, yeah, it's 60 years. Probably a little over 60 years now since the Beatles, like, okay, really boom, popped man. off. Okay, shut the fuck Sorry. up. <laughs> 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 I'm just kidding. Oh, my no, but yeah, dude, isn't that crazy? It's been, like, 60-plus years since, like, the Beatles, like, oh, popped off nuts. and people are still listening to them, like, all the time. Yeah, and, like, half of them are dead. Yeah, half of them are dead. John John Lennon died and George Harrison died. Mm-hmm. Do you know the other two did? Wait, there, there's two of them alive? I thought there was only one that was alive. No, yeah, no. well, you know, well, most of the people, no, I, I'm assuming, who are you going to say? Me? Yeah. Uh, I forgot his name. <laughs> are you serious? <laughs> I know, I know, I actually know, I, I know his name. It's actually kind of bothered me that I don't. I don't remember. Do you, what, what? I don't listen to the Beatles. All right, ready? A, B, C, D. Uh, I'm just Paul McCartney. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, no, I know that. Okay. Duh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Five, second, five, second, uh, five, five seconds of, oh, my God. I can't remember anything. Paul, Paul Mc- I was going to name the one with Rihanna. Forget it. Just. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah he did do a song with Rihanna. Uh, yeah, George Harrison. Uh, no, 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 George Harrison. Uh, Ringo Starr. Ringo Starr is the other one. He's alive. He was, yeah, he's alive. He's the drummer. He, he's the drummer. I don't drummer. believe you. Yeah, no, I knew that, but I don't even think he was alive. Yeah, it's fucking crazy, man. Like, how big they're. How big yeah, it's they insane. Are. It makes no sense. We we but my parents really wanted to see Paul McCartney in concert because they heard that he was touring. Uh, this was a couple years ago, and we were living in Boston, and and he he was coming to Boston to to do a show. And my mom was like, "Oh my god, like we have to go see him. Like like we like that's that's like a must." And so. She gets, like, she has, like, this credit card that, like, allows her to, like, get her, you know, like, like you know, an hour or two hours before anybody else can buy tickets. So we went on, and we bought tickets. And then when the tickets, like, officially came out, the, sh- the show was sold in, like, ten minutes. Like, Holy the show, crap. like, sold out in ten. It was Fenway Park, too, which is ridiculous. Like, imagine, like, imagine, like, like being like, all right, here, I'm coming here, guys. And the tickets are going on sale at, t- you know, 12 p.m. noontime on Saturday. And they're sold out at 12.15. Like that's that's I, I, insane, like, yeah, that's, dude. Speaking of tickets, being just s- imagine being these artists. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's insane. <laughs> it's like here, here's a dude. Quick, literally, like, oh, whatever. He, how much money? He, he was singing. <laughs> he was singing a song. He sang the song, and it was George Harrison's song, and it's like one of the most like beautiful songs like ever on guitar. And he was singing the song, and then you could like hear people crying around you because people are like. Well, did you watch the the one with James Corden with, with him? Yes, dude, I cried during that. That was a really cool. Yeah, movie. I did. I I I did cry during that cuz that like James James did. Corden shut the, 
shut up, David. Do you want me to fly back to Massachusetts or something like that? No, <laughs> just kidding. No, um, James Corden like uh, said like oh you know my granddad would you know get a kick out of this right now. Um, and he was he, his granddad passed away, and then you know and Paul was like talking about like oh you know he he knows you know he's here with us, and it's like it's really sad you know because like I feel like music does do that to you like music does like really like resonate with like a lot of people and like you know it can create like these emotions like that you had no idea that you had and i think yeah, that's definitely. really cool music's thing about a music. universal language bro. yeah yeah but we... there's a lot of songs where like i remember them with random memories like when i first listened to them or something yeah it's kind yeah of yeah yeah that's that were you gonna bring that up or what were you gonna bring up oh <laughs> no i was just when you were talking about tickets like selling out super fast <laughs> i was just <laughs> i remember what... <laughs> Whenever I was trying to buy tickets to Minecon, do you know what Minecon is? No, what is it? It's you, you oh, know the I game Minecraft, that. right? Oh yeah. Oh, you <laughs> no. went to you went to like a Minecraft convention? I didn't go. <laughs> I remember I was trying to buy tickets to it, and like tickets sold out like literally like right when they went up. No this, way. Yeah, the site had like crashed, and like, like tickets like were the gone. Shane Dawson, Jeffrey Star thing. <laughs> Dude, like they literally insane. crashed Shopify. I was like I don't know fourteen or fifteen at the time. Like I was. So was were you like a Minecraft. big gamer? Yeah, I was a really big Steven's gamer. a big gamer. What game? <laughs> what relax with a big gamer. You know what? What, what? what are your favorite games? Oh, we've talked about um, this. Uncharted. Let's see here. Right? Uncharted. Well, favorite. Okay. No, 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 not Uncharted. That, Sorry. Well, it, it, um, it is technically my favorite game. It's a Naughty game, Dog but it's not game. Like, what, what is it? Don't play. I do love Naughty Dog. Yeah, any Naughty game I love. Mm. But I was just playing Red Dead before we uh, started recording. Red Dead. I've uh, okay. been playing that. That's a bunch. Rockstar, right? Uh, Minecraft is an absolute classic. Such a good game. Um, mm-hmm. What else? Grand Theft Auto is just oh my god! Yeah. I've been playing that for from way too young, yeah. probably like six years old. Yeah, everybody <laughs> grew up on Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, man. Grand Theft Auto. I feel like everybody grew up on that game just because yeah. it's such like a it's such like a <clears throat> game where you can like do whatever you want. I remember when I couldn't play Grand Theft Auto because my the parents big question would take is... it away. I you remember that uh, Simpsons game? It's like yes, 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 yes. You, it's like Grand Theft Auto, but the Simpsons. Like, yeah, that's what I would play. Like, we were my... talking about that with like the B movie. <laughs> Really? You know, yeah, I was just game? Yeah. There's a B movie game and it's like literally exactly like like Grand Theft Auto. But um yeah, no, your 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 favorite game, Dave, is uh it's a zombie game with like the girl and like the older like the older. Oh, the Last guy. of Us? Yeah, The Last of Us. Yeah, that's, that's such your, that's a good game. game right? I played that game so many it's, times. It's good, yeah, it's so really good. For the second one. Wait, so uh, do you play on PS4 then? I I I have a PS4 back in Texas. Yeah. <laughs> Well, damn. I have a PS4. I don't. I don't play a thousand video miles games away. <laughs> I just. I. I remember whenever I moved out here, I was like, I need to like really stay focused, like with like what I'm out here for. Yeah. So like. I, I, yeah. I, I try not. I try not to play video games, but my like I have a friend back home who who like literally just call me up and be like, hey, I'm I'm gonna stab you in your heart if you don't get on Xbox and play with me tonight. <laughs> I'm like, all right. <laughs> so I'll, I'll I'll get on and play with him for like an hour or two. Have you seen those memes where it's like. Um, when you're when your boy's like, all right, bro, I'll see you next time. And then it's like <laughs> oh yeah, years later. Yeah, and yeah. Never got there, back there's on. There's a ton of there's a ton of people that like will make TikToks about or just like videos on Twitter, um, where it's like, uh, yeah, yeah, they'll like they'll be like, all right, bro, yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll see you later, and then, like text will pop up, and then it will say like, uh, you know, last like, online, last eight online, years ago. eight years ago, yeah. yeah. But yeah, it's so funny, like. I can't remember, like, the last... Like, I had, like, a group on Xbox. Like, I feel like everybody did. Like, had a group on PS4, a group on Xbox that you played with all the time, like, your friends from school. Right. And, like, yeah, the last time I, like, I played with that group was... It was probably... It was a little... It was a, lo- it was a while ago. It's crazy. And no, no. Actually, no. It was probably last year. Last year when I went... <laughs> my, yeah, yeah. It wasn't that long ago, actually. It was a long time ago. Long I, I was thinking, ago. I was thinking, like, when I graduated high school, because it's coming up on two years now. But nah, it was probably a year ago actually, because I remember we all like I literally texted like we had like a group chat, and I literally texted like everybody. I'm like, hey, we have to get on Xbox tonight. I had a really bad math class today, and I want to play GTA Five. And and then they were like, hell yeah, bro, let's do this. <laughs> and they were like, so the annoying that I can't play with you. I hate that you play on Xbox. It's, it's yeah, like, dude. oh my god. I feel like I feel like is Xbox is like is it more popular than PS4? Absolutely not. <laughs> it's not? Is PlayStation Dude. more popular? Yeah, it's like, I think three times or four times. Wow, that's fucking nuts, dude. I believe that, that that's Xbox the number. I, I could try to find the number. No, well, it used to be, but not on this journey. I I grew up on Xbox, so yeah. like I have like a, you know, like a, I'm biased about Xbox, yeah. but 
I don't know. I like both consoles. I had both. Like, yeah, I was gonna say I I didn't I didn't have both consoles, but my my next door neighbor did. He had like we we would play uh, this game called um, it was with a raccoon. It was uh, no ra- ratchet, or ratchet or something like that. Oh yeah, ratchet and clank. Yeah, yeah. Ra- was it? No, 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 no. Sly Cooper. It was Sly Cooper. Oh yeah, we, <laughs> you would wake it all like PS two or the, even like the original I know PlayStation. And yeah, we would play like Sly Cooper, and they had like the turtle with like. Like the eyes, and he was like, and you got to go down to the, you know, like you have to like go into the. <laughs> Dude, sewer. every time like I hear PS2, the game that like first comes to mind is a uh, Tekken. You know Tekken. Yes, yeah, yeah. I remember like being like a kid and going to, like my uncle's and like he had a PS2. That's freaking crazy. Tekken yeah, there. dude, it's so weird because when I yeah when I think yeah when I think of because I didn't play it but yeah, Sly Cooper was like my PlayStation game but my Xbox game was always uh oh my god I can't remember. I can't. I'm not gonna remember. It was always like call, like a Call of Duty game, maybe it was like Call of Duty uh, like Josh. two or like the big red one or something like that. Yes, David. I just wanted to pull the numbers because oh yeah, just in case you want to know. No, no. no. But Xbox One sold uh, 46 million That's units. That's insane. And PS4 sold 106. Oh my god. Uh, 106 <laughs> million, dude. Isn't that crazy? It's the second best selling console. Isn't that freaking ridiculous? Aren't they coming out with like the PS5? It's not that there's that many shit? people playing. <laughs> What? Is, are they coming out with like the PS5 or some shit? Yeah. Yeah, this year. And like the Xbox. And Xbox. X, and X the or some shit. Oh, I'm yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's freaking crazy, dude. Yeah. It's Josh's bedtime, everybody. Excuse I know. Me. But I, no, I, I think, yeah, I think we'll end it. And then if anybody has any other comments on video games, um, we're going to end it off. Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order was the was best it good? game last year. Yeah, so good. What one game of the year? David, you know that, right? What one game this year or next last year? Like, well, whatever. Wait, like the award show was. <laughs> oh, like like for the last time. Yeah. Uh, uh I don't remember because I didn't care about the last year. <laughs> what did it win? Game of the <laughs> last year, year kind of you know? sucked. Um, game of the year. I think it was a. Uh... Minecraft. Oh, was it? oh wait, it was Sekiro. That was, it was it. Sekiro. I I remembered. No, it's Sekiro. What's Sekiro? It it's like um, I don't know how to explain that one to you. <laughs> do, do, have you ever heard of a Dark Souls? Yeah. It's kind of like that those yeah, types of games, but it was like Dark it's Souls like fan. in like a Japanese type of version. Oh, of it. okay, okay. Honestly, yeah, like I feel like Star Wars should have gotten it because well, I don't know. Sekiro, Star Wars took inspiration from Sekiro, so oh, did they? Yeah, oh, yeah, okay, from the fighting yeah. style and like also from Dark Souls. But, um, Wait, are you talking about the Jedi, like, fall, like Fallen Order, the, the last, last one that just came out? Yeah. I think that would count for this year. So, like, it would be, like, it could still win because it's technically for this next award, not last time's. Right. Oh, really? Because I think it came out after the awards, yeah. I believe so. Like, speaking of other um, good games, you should play Resident Evil 2. That one was such a good so game. good. I played that game. That was really good. Oh, yeah. Alright. That's scary, too. Have you ever played in VR? Oh my god! Last one. I'm not even gonna freaking. I tried it. I wouldn't even do a scary like a scary. Crazy. Like I feel like it's scary. not that bad, honestly. Like but it's, well, it, what it was the, sc- the scariest video game for me? I think was um, PT. PT Silent Hill. That PT was freaking was so crazy. Scary. I was just watching that. I didn't even play that. Dude. You did you that not moment. play it, dude? I just scared the shit. I I just saw like the the freaking girl with the the, the girl hair with like the, the hair. No. She had like the hair honestly, drooping down. Honestly, any girl like, the or baby in a horror game, we're not doing. Dude, it was freaking creepy because you'd go into the bathroom, you'd creep in the bathroom, and it would be like this like. Fetus. Yeah, it would be like a fetus, like a like it wouldn't even be like a. It's not a baby because it has no oh, face. It's just an a, unborn. It was like an unborn. It's not like, even babies. It's just a baby crying sound down hallways or girls like little girls like uh, laughing. Yeah, like that it, stuff. Just I cannot do. Yeah, it was. Yeah, I'm pissed off that they didn't make that into a full. Because Norman Reedus from yeah. freaking Walking Dead, he was the freaking <clears throat> main character, and it was like it was so cool because when you look into like the mirror at the end, it's like it's Norman Reedus, and you're like what. Freaking Norman Reedus. Well, like it's the because uh, the 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 guy making it got fired, so or it got uh, they no, just they had differences like with, like with like how to make it and stuff. Yeah. Probably. yeah, that stinks, dude. I hate when that like happens. Like I was watching a movie, Percy Jackson. I love that movie, dude. It's my favorite movie of all time. And they freaking like. <laughs> <laughs> Doctor's favorite movie of all time changes like every episode. No, no, but it's like it's like one of my like it's like one of my like when I was a kid, it's like my favorite movie ever. Like Percy Jackson. They you were f- a kid? 
No, I was never a kid. I was I was born three days ago. As a <laughs> okay, boomer. As a okay, boomer. This is, the, for, uh, this is the most amount of times I've said okay, boomer. I said okay, boomer. Never say that again. <laughs> but no, like with the last Percy Jackson movie, they just ended it off on a cliffhanger, and it was it, it set up the next movie. And there's supposed to be another movie because there's another freaking stupid ass oh book. Oh god! And it never came. And out. And it never came out. No, they won't make it. They won't <laughs> make it. The studio won't make it. Oh, dang. It's because it's... So yeah, dude, it's so annoying. It was sucks. It, was in a... It was Logan Lerman. I, was... <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't think of her name. Uh, yeah. She was in it, right? Yeah, it was a girl from, it was a girl from ba- it was Baywatch. Alexandra <laughs> Dario. Uh, Dario or something. I don't know like, how you pronounce her last name. It's so fu- it was, uh, I thought it was so funny. She, she made a TikTok... And her bio is is David Dobrik fan account. Yeah. Yeah, and the only person she follows is David Dobrik. I thought that was really funny. But um, dude, it's so weird. Like, how many like girls like David pulls, and like how many like celebrities actually watch oh, no. his videos? But yeah, yeah. I feel like a ton of celebrities too. Like a lot of like kid celebrities too. Yeah. Like a shit ton. Like the whole Stranger Things cast knows who he is, and right. freaking the whole like there's a shit ton of people. I yeah. think it's also crazy like I, how he gets nominated and like wins awards for like his videos, but like he gets demonetized and like pushed back yeah, for like funny? adult yeah. content. Yeah, I think that's yeah, I think <laughs> that's it's a good point. Yeah, no, it is weird. I, like he wins like a YouTube award, and YouTube. Yeah. takes away his money. <laughs> it's like it's like, hey, you've been nominated, hey, but man. we demonetize your videos. Yeah, like, <laughs> hey, congrats on your four awards that you brought home. Like, I feel like his content has been like more like, uh, what do you call it? Like more, what's that word? I don't know. Like like, uh, age made for yeah, made more age appropriate. Like he doesn't really do like all that drunk. They don't stuff. put on rewind. Yeah, yeah, he doesn't do he doesn't do like those drunk stuff. Like you notice, how, like Zayn and them, like they're never like drunk in the vlogs anymore. It's been more about like surprising and like emotional trips. And, yeah, I mean, they, he still like puts like little science like experiments. That. There was a there was it was like a month ago where, like, there was a video of like Zayn getting absolutely sloshed and he broke his elbow. That was a month ago. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yes. So I feel like yeah, I was I was actually. I was watching their video, like, uh, sorry, no, not their video, their podcast, Zane and Heaves, and he, they made such a good point of, like, David basically, like, won life, and now he just kind of has, like, like, he can just do whatever the hell he wants. Like, the life has just become his, like, playground, Yeah. because he has all the money, all the connections, which is kind of insane when you think about that. Yeah, it's, it's like, nuts, dude. He's yeah, he has too. anything he wants to do, it's like, yeah, he can just, he can just do it. <laughs> like, that's so ridiculous. I know, man. He's, he's it's like, insane. the luckiest guy on fucking earth right now. Every time, every time I when I I every co- I've seen like eighty freaking comments on this video of mine, and it's on it's a TikTok video where I it's a, I put it in my vlog but I uploaded like my vlog to TikTok, and literally all the comments are like I can't believe you beat the king of luck at rock paper scissors. Oh yeah, and it's because I beat like a game. <laughs> oh yeah, that is a good point. Yeah, isn't that funny? I thought I was like, oh fuck yeah, dog. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Let's yeah, go. Let's do it funny. again. <laughs> but um yeah, but guys, we're gonna end it. We're gonna end it off, dude. Um, yeah. Do you have anything to say before I sign us um, up? Uh, don't forget to retalk this uh, podcast. <laughs> oh my, dude, that's great. <laughs> oh, retalk, uh, <laughs> rebite, and, um, hey guys. I'm surprised. I'm surprised. <laughs> they have, I'm, I'm, I would not be surprised if everybody's gone now. I mean, I'm just kidding. Nah, dude. I mean, if hopefully you're, if they you're showed up here, to begin with. If you're still here, uh, fucking tag Josh on an Instagram poster. Retweet at John. Yeah, yeah. This is this is actually funny. Yeah, if you if you're still here right now and you're listening to what I'm saying, yeah. go to a post of like Kendall Jenner's or Kylie Jenner's and tag me and say, um, uh, what's it? Retalked. A, retalk. Yeah. <laughs> or no, no. Don't go to Kylie Jenner's post. Actually, don't do that. This be that would look look weird. <laughs> Just go to go to one of my posts and say retalk. <laughs> don't go to Kylie Jenner's page and say that. God, please. <laughs> oh, damn it. <laughs> you just get lost in the feed. Yeah. Oh, my God. That would suck. Oh, <laughs> Kylie Jenner looks at her. Why is there people just saying... Why is there I people mean, tagging this idiot? Does look at her, like, comments? She probably. Gets, like, she she probably has... Yeah, comments. she gets hundreds of thousands of comments. I doubt she looks at any of them. I don't... Yeah, I don't Most think of them are bots. <laughs> Most of them are bots being like, wow, nice picture. <laughs> or, like, people looking for clout. <laughs> yeah. It's like, it's like, hey, guys, so... I uh I do this and that uh you know go to go to my uh, go to my account to look at it up and then up like and coming rapper I'm an up yeah dude it's always the up and coming rapper thing it's like I'm an up and coming singer 
I'm the best okay. Fortnite player on Xbox. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, it's so oh, annoying. Man. But guys, that's it for today's podcast. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Like Actually, no, you can't. There's literally nothing to like or subscribe. Oh, uh, you can't. I, or, I guess, or you can follow. Well, it. I guess our YouTube channel, which we don't really post on anymore, because we just put the audio version now. Yeah, yeah, no, but we, yeah, we maybe don't. we'll. I don't know. Yeah, maybe but we'll guys, follow Isai. Eventually. It's oh yeah, we gotta we gotta t- tell people how to pronounce your name. Right, it's Isai. That's it. Like a not Isai, like a Isai bowl. It's no, E E <laughs> No, sir. It's Isai. I S A I Isai. Sir. Sir, yes, sir. Yes, um, sir. And then, yeah, go follow him on everything. Look for him in the next movie theater that you go into. And follow me on TikTok. Next Star Wars. I want to hit 50,000 by Calling summer. Calling it now. Five years from now, there's going to be a ton of people coming to this exact podcast going, oh my god. Isai. Isai, you Freaking were on Josh's podcast. Josh's podcast. Fucking... 10 views on this podcast and now it's like <laughs> now it's freaking 80,000 <laughs> oh my that's god that's what's crazy I feel like that's what a movie can do like if you're like in a movie like your life blows up instantly like Daisy Ridley you know, you know what's Wars, crazy I, I, I don't think I ever told you this uh, I see a couple like famous people in the audition room sometimes when I go in for the for these auditions yeah I saw uh, I mean, Chris Hemsworth spit on me one time. <laughs> no, 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 not those kind. Of, dude, no, those like those level celebrities never have to go audition. No, rooms. they no, they get sent the script. Right? Yeah, they yeah. get sent or they go straight to like the, the producers. Yeah. And um, it's crazy though. Like I saw, uh, I don't know if you know this show called The Party of Five. Mm-mm. No, it's it's like a really new show. It's a it's a reboot. I saw Nico. He's uh, one of the leads. Oh, that's cool. In the audition room, I saw. Uh, Did you see? You, I remember you said you saw Cole Sprouse. Yeah, I saw Cole Sprouse at a party at one time. That's so cool. Um, I saw I mean, oh, what's his name. I saw one of the Thirteen Reasons Why kids in the audition room. I can't oh, remember yeah. what his name is. Yeah, mm. that must be like kind of weird. I don't know about weird, but like that must be like interesting to like see them. Like they're like, oh, they're going for the same role like as I am. Like, fuck yeah, those. like I want to get this role. Right. You guys are like competing back and forth. Yeah, that's so crazy, man. Yeah, that's interesting. But guys, that's it. Um, I don't know what else to say. Uh, I'm, all right, David. I'm just gonna. I'm literally gonna hang up the phone call with David, and I'm unplugging my mic. Bye, well, everybody. Just uh, unplug, dude. Unplug. Yeah. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! That's <laughs> great. <laughs>